rude or whatever, you can't go wrong. Like it, these guys love it. Yeah, mm-hmm. I don't. I don't take like grudges or anything. Kind of like how Jared does. <laughs> Did you call him Jared? <laughs> Wait, is his name Jared or Garen? Jared. Garen. <laughs> Jared. Yeah, I went. I went to WrestleMania. Oh god! That's how he talks. You know what's funny is I don't even I don't care whether he did or not. I yeah, almost think <laughs> I almost think he did, but I don't really. Care. I think he did it's to be honest. Funny. It's just really funny. I, I, get, I don't know if you did you watch his interview. I I get what he I, said with, with Dave. Yeah, I did, and uh, the thing was he had a lot of excuses, which made it seem that he didn't go. But in a sense, he kind of makes you believe that he did. No, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, like he. But who like, the fuck cares? You know, only Tommy saying. is like the yeah. the one that thrives. No, off of. you never went. You little bastard. You little bastard. You see? Let no, me tell you something. He, you know, he makes me feel like you know, yeah, he come with a lot of excuses, but I get what he says. Like for instance, about yeah, like selfies. I don't do that shit. I'm gonna take pictures, but I will be taking. I a lot fucking of pictures. hate that. I completely relate to him. Well, but it's still like. Even so, unless my phone dies, I'm gonna probably take a lot of pictures, a lot of video of something. Yeah. So the fact that he did had nothing except like a a sign you could have found on Google Images that still makes me question it. Damn. But I don't give a shit. I think it's funny. Let me tell you something. The way Tommy, I don't know if you ever did, if you watched how Tommy uncovered it with him, that was hilarious. Nah, uh, how was it? Uh, so how how long? Uh, so how long till you guys get home? Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Hours. Yeah, wait a minute. That that's like a fourteen-hour drive. He had all the shit calculated. <laughs> he totally got it with the logistics. It was great. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, how did he do his voice? This is like so hard to perfect. Who? Tommy. It's like. Oh, oh Tom. Well, you gotta you gotta put your balls in a vice. <laughs> squeeze real tight, you know. Hey there. Yeah. No, hey, no, I lost it for a while there. Like, um, <laughs> you got to get that high pitch, you know? Yeah. I naturally am low, so. No, but. Cronin, you're crazy. Yeah, there you go. See? You just keep doing it. Yeah. Everybody yeah. does it now. It's like time. Everybody does that, and it's funny. Everybody did. No. It's a fun voice, you know? No, it is. The guy's fucking gold. He's a character in himself. And then if you go to his channel, he, like, overdoes it, like, Hey, guys, it's shot from the point. <laughs> These jokers. <laughs> oh, is he making a move? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, oh, nobody shit. talks like that except, like, mobster, mobsters in a fucking movie. Yeah, see, yeah, we're gonna stop yeah, it. Right, see, yeah, I'll, I'll fuck his, I'll get his wife and I'll, I'll make her make me dinner, see? <laughs> Make some big ZD, see? <laughs> he used to make me some big ZD, you see, and then I'll fuck her. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I hope Joe's, Joe's probably not recording this because he's a cunt, but. Joe's listening, I think, man. Yeah, he probably this is. Probably you motherfucker. <laughs> he's probably got a toothbrush on his penis. Is he, with a... me... Yeah, he is. It says he is. Well, yeah. I don't fucking know, man. I hope he's alright, and his uh, daughter. Purple mouth. Quit eating the goddamn paper. It's not chemicals. It's sci- I like science. <laughs> that killed me when he said that. I like science. I, lo- I love how fucking Leah is. It's science. It's fucking science. <laughs> now Leah's the best. I, I, I wish she like needs that. to be on every uh, monetize this. I like the, the monetize this where uh, she was in it. The Leah episode apparently. Oh, I swear, no, she's been in a couple. but The latest I, one though. Yeah, yeah, it was great. Like I've been trying to tell, I tell, I've been saying it for months. Like she's golden. Every she's like the serious time. type, but he, he jokes. She's serious, but it's so funny. It's like Dave when he gets serious. It's funny, and she can put us all in our place, and that's what makes it even funnier. A bunch of dumbass guys, and this chick comes in and just floors everybody. Yeah. Like, no, you guys are idiots. And then when twice. fucking Dave, Dave did that to her. That thing. Yeah, I feel like I've said. had more dumps than you've had breaths of air, so <laughs> shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh, my God. She talked to me like I'm some asshole. Oh, oh, Leah, I'm so sorry. That was, I think she, like, has mad respect for him for that or something. Like, just more funny. respect for him than uh, Joe. Right? Yeah, at <laughs> least she's got balls, Joe. Damn. 
Oh he's listening. God. He's hearing every word you're saying right now. Probably he's he's losing it right now. He's like, God damn it. It. He's like, yeah, but Dave can't feel his dick, so fuck it. Dabba dabba do. God. <laughs> oh man, that video was funny that they made with uh, the John Cena thing. Did you see that? Did, yeah, I did. Did you happen to act, uh, even better? Did you happen to hear the hour and I don't know, hour and a half that they did on iTunes? What? Um, it, it was about the NFL. It was about the Hold game. On. That just I, it's in my podcasting. I think it, uh, I'll yeah, tell you the it, title of it right now. The, yeah, it's really good. Is it? Uh, where is it? It's about the NFL. Oh shit! No, I didn't. I listened oh, to the, the state of WWE one, but not that one. Oh man, you gotta listen to the NFL one. It is so good. It's, it's, right it's like a hour and twenty five. It, it's shit. yeah. It, it's like just Dave and Joe doing like a monetize this. It was so good. Oh, and shit. then and then Tommy comes on. Oh fuck. And C or no? Nope. Um, which one? Tommy C. But it's <laughs> hilarious because the moment he comes, he starts. Dave starts talking about how his dick doesn't work right. <laughs> <laughs> and Tommy just starts giggling, and, and that's how Tommy enters the conversation. That's how he enters. He just starts laughing. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And it's just too much, man. It's fucking hilarious. Oh, poor Dave. I just, I just can't find it. It's not Dave's there, Corona. fucking man. Oh. You saw the shirt I made for him? Which one? I made, like, this uh, Daniel Bryan type shirt for Dave. Oh, I don't think I've seen it. It's pretty awesome. I've seen just, the copious He looks cup. so funny. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's that. It's that. It's, it's just that on his shirt, but... His face like came up priceless. Copious amounts of turds. Copious amounts of dick. I like your idea of uh, Benoit plus your family, or Benoit versus your family. Oh, that's a fucked up shirt, but that would work. But I'll fucking get that one. What was another good one? Uh, there's a lot of good ones we could use with with all these guys. The shit that they come up with. Yeah, we'll make you one. Oh, Let me tell you something. No, you're crazy. Like, you would just have a Tommy C shirt, right? Shot from the point on the back. It just said, let me tell you something. And then, ha ha, I just have a bunch of laughs. <laughs> yeah, he, he has a pull string on it, and you pull it. It just does the laugh. His laugh is crazy. Like, ah! Yeah, he loses it. He just loses it, man. He goes, Roger Rabbit. <laughs> oh, my God. Like, that's what I want to do, too, is I want to get the clip from Roger Rabbit where it, he goes, why well, we should stop that laughing? <laughs> I mean, like, yeah, I, I love that movie. Part. Yeah, I want to get that part, and then it just keeps, it says, like, oh, would you quit laughing? And then quit it just laughing. has Tom, and it just has him in the back. Would you <laughs> quit laughing? I'll find that for you. What's your not Twitter? The, not the dip. The Twitter? I don't have a Twitter anymore. Oh, what? What happened? Uh, oh, I quit. Cl- no, I closed it down. I closed everything. Do you have a Facebook? No, I, I, I used to, but I deleted that one. Oh, fuck. Because, like, a lot of, like, uh, people... Well, I don't... This is going to sound fucked Like, like teens. Teens don't use Facebook anymore, apparently. Like, it, it's uh, MySpace now. Who doesn't use Facebook? I don't fucking know. Uh, teens. A lot of teens now. They, they think it's, like, MySpace. What the fuck are they using? Twitter. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. It's like fully switched, apparently, this era that we've entered. Oh, they've gone full retail. Twitter and fucking Instagram. Oh, Instagram. There you for go. For the ladies. <laughs> and for the dick pics. This summer. Let me tell you something. You want to see my dick? <laughs> Schlong's view. One man, one desire, one dig pig. Dude, that's pretty good. Like, just the voice you just did. Thank you. Holy you see, shit. I, I do voice impressions. Like, I used to be the governor of California. Oh, I, I I, could... That wouldn't work. I like the one you did a minute ago, because it was, like, original, but it, it worked. I don't know. You know uh, Christopher Walken? Oh, yeah. Oh, Wow. See, I dropped my potatoes. 
I don't fucking know. I like I like the the voice trailer one. That's probably the best one. They're like every day. Oh, okay, I got you. In a world. In a world. Holy shit, see that's really good. <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell, that's the thing that sucks about having like your your own voice and then you like do like different ones. You can't tell if it's good because you you're so used to one voice. Well, the one you did right now is really good. Like, uh, you should show that to Joe. Shit. Yeah, I, I could do like little trailers, you know. Cause I'm doing I'm doing film right now. I want to be a. I want to I want to do like what Seth Seth Rogen did. He, like he's he's an actor, but he's also a director. Oh, yeah, you can smoke a lot of weed and make a movie. <laughs> I mean. <laughs> <clears throat> <laughs> 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 No, no, so what do you mean? You want to do what? I want to be an actor and a director. Okay. Be like a filmmaker, you know, hopefully, I don't know if I will, but like, if I'm a millionaire, you know, hopefully things go good, you know, I'll ship you guys uh, a gift basket. <laughs> <laughs> I'll give you guys a, a gift basket with some cheese in it. <laughs> no, no, Fucking well, cheese and wine. Like, well, you said three, yeah, right. You said three different things there. Like, what what would be your um if you had to pick one that was your? Oh, uh, probably uh, ah, that would be fucking hard. Like directing, acting, writing, directing. Uh, directing. Yeah, like, that's the thing about directing. You do like, you have to write the storyline if if it's well, no, an no, original piece. Well, no, no, not necessarily. Well, no, no. Yeah, you're yeah. right. You're right. You have but writers. Like, uh, the how I want to do, I want to write my own material. Well, yeah, but directing in itself is like that's a huge job. That's why I'm yeah. asking. Which one? Are we, which one are you? I would like, probably do that. The directions. So you you want to be the whole bit, the whole, everything. I want to be like uh, Michael Bay without the Michael or the Bay. <laughs> you want to be a control freak? <laughs> I wouldn't be that, man. I'll be like a funny type, like improv type guy, because I think improv is one of the best things. You're right. It absolutely is. You you control things too much, and you you don't let it kind of happen. Yeah. And it ruins the magic. Yeah, look at my mom. She's fucking out of out of this world. <laughs> now I'm confused. Now I'm confused. My mom. <laughs> oh, she good looking? Man. Nah, just kidding. Nah, I have no idea. <laughs> I can't answer that, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Oh fuck, Cronin's probably like, oh yeah. my god. I know. I'm, I'm getting into like, what's weird is I'm doing what the fuck Joe was, Joe was doing uh, when he was my age. I'm getting into music as well, band and shit. But I want to get into film. And How hopefully old are things you? will set off. I'm 18. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm into like the whole punk rock metal shit. Not Screamo. No. I hate that. That's fucking... You play anything? You play music? Uh, I play guitar and uh, I'm trying to sing. I can't. That, I can't sing that good. But eh, you go go for what you. Meh. You know, go for what you can do. It's a side thing, you know. Music's a side thing, side project. And you so your big thing is like uh, film. Uh, yeah, and I do editing too. Like I was I just gonna music. say, how about editing? Like, is that yeah, a? I love thing? editing. Okay. It's like a little video game, you know. That's why I do the stuff I do with the layouts. It kills time. You just get pure enjoyment out of it. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> That's good. Because that was always my problem is, um, yeah, it's good to have dreams. It's good to have aspirations and uh, all that good stuff. But if you're doing it for that reason, which I mistakenly I've done, where you're doing it and you want it to be bigger than than it is, and it, you, you have yeah. to just do it out of enjoyment. And it, and if you're good at it, it will become whatever you want. But the fact that you do it out of enjoyment is really where it's got to start. Yeah, you know? yeah, I completely agree. Yeah, I mean, I used, I still like I'm still having to get used to writing things. Like when I write something, I have always written it for other people. Like it's like okay, this is gonna make anyone I show this to is gonna they're gonna love it. Do you like to uh, write? Where it's like, eh, you know what? I'm going to worry about whether I love it and then other people will inherently love it because I do. You know what I mean? Like I've yeah. learned that it's like, you have to be happy with what you're doing. And if you're happy with it and you're confident about it, other people will fucking dig it or, and they'll get it. 
Yeah. So, like that's one thing. I, so it's cool that you like have just this natural love to do what it is you're doing. So whether you get paid or not, like if if you love it no matter what, that's the biggest biggest key. You like writing? Yeah, definitely. What do you like to write? I'm out of practice, but uh something that's beneficial for me meaning it it releases something and expresses something that I can't get past but it also I like it to be inspirational to a lot of people <laughs> even if uh, it doesn't seem like it like um, even if cryptically subliminally it has a message that others can grab out of it like I like that nice uh, you know like philosophical shit I guess is the way to put it yeah like Halloween nigga <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm taking your candy and I'm tricking your treat. I didn't see that's the only song I haven't heard. Halloween nigga? Yeah. You've heard the chorus, right? I know. Oh my god. No, I've I've heard I've heard uh like only when you say it or when he they bring it up. But they never oh fucking play it. Oh my god. That's why I had he to fish out silly Sandy and bring it <laughs> down. Yeah. <laughs> I remi I remixed that by the way. I I heard you uh saying I don't remember the doubling. That was me. I also do mixing for audio. Oh yeah yeah okay I heard that yeah when he when the, he did the doubling for um. Bring you down. Yeah, Hulk. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hol see the Halloween. He never released that. He put it on a video, but he never re oh, he shit. released it because that shit's fucking hilarious. Damn it, it's like a needle in a haystack looking for those. It is. It really is. It took me all day to look for two songs. <laughs> <laughs> no, jo you know, Joe's fucking, like, the monetize this, is, it's just the raw reviews. Anything since he started, it'd take you a while, but, like, every episode has so much gold in it. You just have to dig it out, timestamp it. It's such a pain in the ass. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But there's so much, like... He didn't have time, but you you could make three hour compilation of just best of shit, or maybe more, of just best ofs, whether it be callers or, I don't know. He'll he'll rush something like he'll put together like a best of really quick, but if if we did a proper one, it would take hours. I mean, it it would it would actually take weeks, but it would play for hours. It would be insane. <laughs> I mean, like a movie. So he doesn't remember half the shit, but I do because it was, it just, it, it, I just do. Uh, there was so much shit yeah, like when he it. first started. Um, hashtag like when he first did his hashtag fact shit. I mean, a lot of that stuff. There was so many uh, shit. He, I don't know. It, it was cool. Even the stuff that Jaron did in the beginning. There were some funny bits with everybody. So, mm, yeah, yeah. What are you gonna do? I hope I have one, at least one. What moments? Yeah, I think I your moments, but your your moments probably come out through the fucking visual things that you've made. Yeah, I'm like the visual. Because like, you guy. haven't called you haven't called in as much as as you you've been shown through your artwork and stuff. Yeah, that's how like he usually shouts me out and everything. I've been calling every pay per view, but I don't know. Every Trust pay per view I call in, but it's like for a while. Well, people know your name, and it's it's because of the art, like the background. Rojas. They have. They always roll the R. It makes me freaking laugh. Roll your R's, Joe. Roll your R's, damn it. Listen, if they ever say my name, I want you to say "Roll your R's, damn it," okay? Roll your R's, damn it. Or Joe, I don't know. You say something after it. Are you you fucker. <laughs> roll your no. You roll the R's like the Russian <laughs> sheep. <laughs> Oh man! Oh man! Cover juice guy. <laughs> that was pretty funny. The the bits that you had with the Iron Sheik. Every time I do him, though, sweet. fucking everybody goes. Uh, I don't know, everyone says, oh, "Was it the Irish Sheik?" The Iron Sheik. Because <laughs> uh, I guess I go Irish when I do it. The Iron Sheik, mate. Lassie. I'll tell you all your Jews out there. The Iron Sheik, Lassie. See, you roll those R's like a son of a bitch. See? Me? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, see? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's always something to say with a lot of R's. I don't know. Maybe goddamn Chewbacca. <laughs> <I can't. laughs> 
<laughs> it feels weird. It's wait, natural. Wait, I'm rolling my eyes. You see? Look. <laughs> yeah, if they ever tell you to roll your eyes, I'll do it, and they wouldn't even know. It'll just say it's you. <laughs> oh shit man so it's uh 2.55 here so over there it's uh when it's almost midnight oh okay I was, so it's uh, 11.55 yeah three hours oh I thought it was five. Oh shit oh hell no <laughs> No, uh, between uh, yeah, between California and New York, three hours. Same with Joe. Yeah, me and Joe got the the same slot. Yeah. And then uh, the ones that are fucked up are uh, Tommy and Dave. Fucking, I don't know how they do it, especially like Tommy v uh, watching the pay per views live, right? Yeah, I don't think he he might watch the pay per views, but he. He doesn't even show up to the raw reviews, and if he does, yeah, he like he just he just showed up today, right now at the end. He'll wake up and just come in. Like I've told him, I said, just be there. Don't even watch raw. Don't worry about it. Just be there, because he they got to get up early. I mean, yeah. Fucking what's his name? Uh, Dave. He gets up fucking early, watches the fucking raw, and then deals with the show. So, man, They're, were they both in the military? Yeah. That's how they met. Holy shit! Apparently That's they crazy. met at a. Apparently they met at a card game. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? They were playing poker. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. Yeah, yeah gambling. Gambling scene. No, I I really like the uh, the the poker idea that they're throwing around. Did they have uh, any videos? Yeah, you should check. They're actually really good. It's like a monetize this sort of. <laughs> um, well, really, like they, they've done a couple test runs and they're long and they're not everything is gold. But if you if you just sit, you know, you do something around the house, gold. Whatever, you throw it on, do something else and you'll you'll hear these bits of gold come up like every show they've done of the shot from a point poker. That's that's the name of the channel, by the way, shot from the point poker. Um, or shot from the point channel, but it, it isn't that. Like they, they have these callers on. Like it's funny. The very first episode, this guy uh, Roy calls up, and he's him and Dave have the same fucking stimulator in their ass. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> that sounds dirty, oh, but uh, no. But for real, like they both have the same injury, kind of. So it it was it was it's interesting. Like there's um. I don't know, there's different shit going on. That show is really good. It, it's like, um, I'm waiting for Cronin and the rest of us to get on there, though. I think it'll be interesting to see how, how that... How does it even work? You buy a, a program for poker or something? Uh, or is there a website? I think it's free. Well, I have, it's free to get the software, but... Uh, uh, then membership. Tommy, Tommy makes a, um, what is it, a, a club, and then everybody joins it. Uh, yeah, and that way, like, um, say you guys, say, like, the Joe Cronin fans, like, want to come on and play a few hands. All they got to do is uh, get a get an account and then join the club. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I know nothing about poker. Thank you. Uh, I know a little bit. It's That's the funny thing about it. Dave and Tommy are both really, like, hardcore players. Like, they'll play for money. <laughs> and uh, me and Joe, we don't really give a fuck. Um, so it'll be really funny to see how that goes, I think. Yeah, same and, and, here. And then you got uh, Dave Rose, who's, like, super serious about his poker, you know. Uh, I, I, I really like to get in the head of the opponent. And uh, <laughs> I, I like to bluff him. I only play Italian style. <laughs> Italian style. Yeah, I guess it's yeah, it's some crazy shit. He, he, Dave's funny because he wants to be he wants to be real serious about it, and the rest of us are just like, who gives a fuck? It's it's a it's a bit. It's funny. He's like, no, it's a serious Tommy. This is uh, it's poker. <laughs> and uh, when I play poker, I I play to win or I'll kill you. 
god. I'm out of call my mama. <laughs> what the fuck is stuck in my head now? Son of a bitch dinosaur guy comes out. Son of a bitch. He's in fucking TNA now. You watch any of do you watch any other uh wrestling companies? No, I don't watch any shit like that right now. How's he doing on TNA? Uh he's a a bodyguard. Well not a body like a real <laughs> uh <laughs> not like a a bodyguard like for a stadium or anything. He's like a that's his character. He's some bodyguard for uh Dixie Carter's nephew. If I was the crowd I'd be like Somebody call my mama. Yeah, they're always in fucking New York now because they, they're thinking about moving over here because they got shut down by Universal. So they're not going to be there for that long. So I'll, I'll check it out one day if they're ever here again. But What, so they're, main, they're mainly in New York? Uh, they still go, but yeah, they are mainly in, in the Manhattan Center and over here in the city. But uh, they go to... Right now, I think they're going to the UK. Hmm. Yeah. Munch up, Brits. Yes. Pip, pip. Cheerio. <laughs> Cheerio, then. All that good shit. Yeah. yeah. But I, the thing I, I don't think that Joe or uh, Tommy or Dave knows is that I, I know a lot about wrestling. Like, I've watched the, the old products, and I even watch other companies like Ring of Honor and Lucha. Yeah. And and uh, TNA. So, so I, I'm, I'm into the independent scene. There's like a company right here in Brooklyn. Uh, it's called House of Glory. And uh -huh. You ever heard of Amazing Red? No. Okay. That's good. So, no it isn't. It's... <laughs> <laughs> it, he's like a, a guy that was in TNA, but he was like one of the best X Division uh, champions. Which is kind of like cruiserweight. So he has he's like coaching people now to go to Ring of Honor, to go to NXT, or hell even even TNA. Oh, so he's trying to get him up to the to the big stage. The big boys, the big guys. Oh yeah, stupid. <laughs> Well, so if, if you've got some knowledge, why don't you, you should call in more? I mean, I try. That's the thing. I, I go to sleep sometimes uh, after the shows, but today I'm just wide awake. Well, no, but I, I mean, like, like uh, if you've got something to say, see, like, that's the thing. A joke goes with emotion, but sometimes we need new new blood on the show. Like, sometimes we need some new callers. So I get I tired of just uh, Tony calling in, you know what I mean? Who's Tony? Oh, but you know, who's Tony? Oh, you know the the guy, <laughs> the, the kid that the kid that always calls in. You know who's Tony? The Give the one who's always playing uh, Grand Theft Auto with Tommy. <laughs> yeah, I remember him. Yeah, he's cool. Uh, I love that guy. Actually, it's just like Grand Theft Auto. I love the mo the thing that excites me the most is when we get new callers or when somebody has something new to say. And if you've got something to say, especially on the wrestling, you should definitely call uh, in. Like that's probably like. That would kind of be like my, if you if you would say like character, you know, I, I look into uh, the physics and uh, the the pacing of the actual moves, and uh, if the, if the two wrestlers have chemistry, you know, like yeah. for example, Big Show and uh, Eric Rowan, they have horrible chemistry. chemistry. If you ever saw that match in TLC and Sears. No, I didn't, but I go. Oh, I can imagine. Don't 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 see it. That's all I'm going to say. It's one of the worst matches of the year. I mean, poor Big Show. I mean, he's still a name, but the guy, I don't know if anyone has a good match with him anymore. They're pushing him, though, right now. They're and trying. He's not, he's not going, doing bad, but I think if they, like, stop the tires with him, okay. it's probably his last breath. You know, yeah. in the Hall of Fame, Undertaker. I want to, yeah, I'd love to see Undertaker's speech. Hell of insanity. I never do it. <laughs> Said I'd never be here. Vince, when you asked me if I'll lose my streak, you remember when I said, Vince, suck my balls. I'll do it, Vince. <laughs> I don't think you wanted to end the streak. I'm not sure. Oh, of course you did. That was some of the best business they did, really. 
Uh, that's where I agree with Dave. Like that, that would be like a huge sequel, basically. Sequel. Yeah, like or you know, if they did that, like a Brock and Undertaker Lesnar? part two. Yeah, Lesnar and Undertaker. It would. Yeah, it would but still what make happens? Money. I don't care. I don't care. Even if everyone knew Undertaker was gonna lose, it would draw. At this Undertaker point, Undertaker wins again. How does that benefit him? He already lost one, so the streak is. No, I mean, it, it doesn't even matter. It, people wouldn't even care because people would lose their shit that it was even happening. Um, it, It's weird because even though, like, people like us or me, would, like, we would be like, eh, is this even going to be good? But mm-hmm. a lot of people wouldn't care. I mean, look at the, the, I don't know if you know, but, like, our fucking WrestleMania we did is probably up to 550,000 fucking views now. Jeez, Jesus. Um, like over half a million views, and that, that's probably the biggest numbers Joe's ever done for something. And it's because of the fucking Brock and Undertaker thing. That that is totally the reason that thing got so many hits. Yeah. Just like and, tonight, Sting. Yeah, I mean, it it, it kind of drives me nuts because it's a nostalgia thing, and that's all it really. That's all I see it as. Mm-hmm. But it. <sighs> I really do think things are going to get a little better, but I don't know, man. I've been saying this whole time that, you know, it's all bullshit. Reigns is going to be their guy. <laughs> so uh, maybe I'm I right. It. I hate Reigns. Yeah, I, yeah it's a shame because he looks like a cool guy and all. I think the problem is he... The mic skills. He's and too he nice. Wrestle. To, yeah, I don't even know about that. I just think no, he... because you know. I, know, I know how you feel. Like, have you ever seen him in NXT? NXT? No. All right. Well, before he was uh, Roman Reigns, he he was called Taliki. He was like some uh, tribal tribal dude. He had uh, Daniel Bryan type attire, and his hair was a little short, so his name's Taliki. He he wasn't doing the same three moves that you see him doing now. He was doing a bunch of uh, suplexes, acrobatic, uh, over the top rope moves, and his finisher wasn't even the. The spear, I think. I think it was a, a power bomb, but it was okay. sick because he like he flipped himself, I think, after to make like a cover up pin. Okay. So, uh, th- I think it was it was Vince that fucked him up. He's writing the promos for the dude. Well, you know what I see with that guy though too is I well I as far as the NXT thing, like on your side from what you just said, it makes him sound better than. From what I've heard from other people, he hasn't changed at all. It's the same guy that was there five years ago. But yeah, at yeah. the end of the day, I, whether it's Vince or not, uh, I I think the guy's just too nice a guy, and he's a little bit too timid to to make you believe Did, what he's he needs even to the, the the outro. I'm not an outro. The intro. Did you see the intro to Raw? No. He's, he's the last guy they show right before the logo pops up, like what they did with Cena. Okay. So they're making him the number one guy. Well, yeah, that's that's the bad and the good thing. I mean, I, I think <laughs> good is they can make him a sh- they can, he can make him a shitload of money. I'd love to see that guy do like action movies or whatever the fuck. I think he'd be killer in some shit like that. But it, it's hard. You know, well, acting? Action wise, yeah, he he looks not like not the acting, type. not like a great movie, but like ain't Rambo, no like an ass kicker type. Yeah, like some shit like Steve Austin's doing, you know. Yeah, like I could totally see that because he's good looking guy. The best thing about him is he's got the fucking look. He looks like a million bucks. If if you put him in a movie, he's gonna look like an ass kicker. He's gonna look great in the ring, though. I mean, especially when it's live TV, he's better in the back with his promos than he is in the ring. He doesn't get like when the crowd's there. He get you could tell he shits his pants, and it's I can't blame him. The, guy, the guy's a little timid, and I don't think he's got that charisma that you have to have. And you know that's that's just a shame. Yeah, but yeah. he's gonna get pushed. I think it's good though. I, I think it really is a good thing. It's just I don't want him to be all the end all be all of what's going on. So you think he's gonna win the rumble? Uh, see, I don't know enough about what they're doing, but everyone else seems to think he is. Uh, I've been, like, I think so, but the thing is, I didn't watch Raw, but based on what everyone says about Raw and about the setup... He didn't have that much like of a attention. He didn't have, like, a big spot today on Raw, so... They but they make, it, so they make it sound like he's getting booked to win Rumble. Oh, shit. I don't know, though, because I didn't watch Raw. I think Raw. If, if, it, if, if it was anyone uh, today... They made 
look like they would run win the rumble. It would probably be either. We'll see. I can't say Seth. So. Uh, what about Daniel Bryan? Wyatt. Wyatt. Oh. Wyatt looked phenomenal today. I think Wyatt or Daniel are the only two that I think would win the rumble. You don't think Reigns is gonna win at all? Uh, he could be like in the final two, but it's very predictable. Well, I could see all three or four of those guys being in the final. Four. I'm gonna say Wyatt <laughs> is gonna fight the Undertaker at Mania, so he's out. Brian could face Lesnar, or Reigns could face Lesnar. <sighs> but Wyatt, I mean, uh, Daniel already had his moment, so I think Reigns, who Vince McMahon like loves, is probably gonna win. They're going to want to push Reigns. No doubt about man. it. He's hot yeah, right well, now. I didn't think about it, but now now I think about it, I think Reigns is going to fucking win it. Oh, he's, he's hot right now. And, like, you can't deny the guys. I mean, he is hot, but it, the problem is... Him or Ziggler. But Ooh, it, it, Ziggler? I think it's, it's whatever sells the, the main event for Mania. That's the thing. Roman Reigns is going to sell that. And that's the problem, but it's also the, it's also the truth. I mean, mo with exactly. all the women and kids, like, they're going to totally get behind that. They wouldn't put Ziggler versus Lesnar. Ooh. Or why? It wouldn't make sense booking-wise. I would or, love to see yeah. Ziggler take those bumps. Oh, my I God. I think... Oh, yeah. Jesus Christ. He would look like he was killing himself already. Like, oh, my God. Take, taking those suplexes, he would fucking bounce off his neck. <laughs> oh, that'd be great. Yeah. But Daniel oh. never lost the belt, so I see... Either Daniel or Reigns makes sense. Well, you know, The Rock has a has a title shot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> God, I don't even know. Randy Orton comes back. I really well, think that they're kind of still chasing their tail. I think I they should know. fucking do that. Like, what I what? heard you guys saying that on... Uh, oh, The Rock comes out with his fucking everybody, lawyer? Everybody. <laughs> <laughs> the Rock. Where was that? Was that the state of WWE? Oh, my God. Yeah, I think it was. Oh, man, that was fucking hilarious. That was a pretty good little piece. Though. That was hilarious, man. <laughs> <laughs> and then Stone Cold comes out. <laughs> and then right after that is when they did that other thing with the, him taking his shirt off. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my well, God. Well, uh, if y'all want to see Stone Cold get a rematch from 1993, give me a hell yeah. From <laughs> 1993? Yeah, WCW. <laughs> Now, the ringmaster was one hell of a shitty gimmick, Vince. <laughs> I still don't forgive you for that. I didn't get to fucking win my WCW world belt. Man. You think they'll split brand the brands again? Say that again? You think they'll uh, split the brands again, like SmackDown and Raw? I don't know. To be honest, like, it's 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 going into the past if they it's do. It's kind of pointless, though. That's what I think. Like, I think that anything they do needs to keep moving forward. Like, I don't know. They need to really break the mold again. I think SmackDown's amazing uh, last week. Wait, Hopefully no, it's think, like that again. When did you start watching this shit? When I started watching... Uh, Wrestling. WWE or wrestling in general? Wrestling, yeah, wrestling. Uh, I I I liked uh, ECW, so that was like around oh. ninety nine or two thousand. That was your first introduction. Yeah. Oh wow. ECW, because I was I was an edgy guy, you know. I didn't. Well, I still am edgy, but like, I liked the the hardcore animated shit. I didn't like WWE because it was very cartoony and it was a main street, the mainstream type thing. Same thing with WCW. But my first WWE match that I've seen is, uh, it wasn't even a match. It was, uh, Shawn Michaels doing the Master Lock Challenge with Chris Masters. You remember that? No. <laughs> you <don't... laughs> no, cause I stopped watching in, um, 2001. That's, that's when I, I stopped watching right after, uh, ECW got the plug pulled. But then oh, in two, 2006, flipping the channels, I see Shawn Michaels, switch him using, switch him using some uh, dude named Chris Masters, and uh, yeah. I was like, oh snap, this is pretty cool. 
And it's the that only was your, that was when you first got into WWE. Yeah, then that was like a who was champion? Fuck, I think Kurt was champion. Kurt Angle. Right at the beginning of Ruthless Aggression is when I started. Wait a minute. Now, Ruthless Aggression, I thought, was like 2002, 2003. No, that's that's at the, like the end of Attitude. Uh. Yeah, because Rock was still there. Stone Cold. Oh, so you started watching. Okay. Yeah. That's yeah. interesting. But I obviously, after that, I obviously looked like at the, the past uh, DVDs and WCW Bash at the Beach. All that old shit. Yeah, fucking WCW, except for, like, when it was getting good with the cruiserweights and stuff. Like, I... I... If it wasn't those, Brad... Those were all from ECW. What? The cruiserweights. Those are just basically... Oh, the, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're absolutely right. They still uh, Eddie Guerrero, Dean Malenko. Yeah, those... those it, yeah, it's pretty Syria. crazy. I, um, if it wasn't for Attitude Era, though, I, or, you know, basically for WWE making it cool, I would have never gotten into wrestling, because it was just, anytime I ever tuned in before, like, when I was really young, yeah. it just looked stupid. I was like, what is this shit? <laughs> uh, the way they dressed, the fact that I knew they weren't hitting each other. Yeah, that, that was a big factor. Attitude, you know, I watch Attitude Era, like, I'm like, some motherfucker just hit him with a chair. <laughs> you know, that was real. Yeah, he the, fucking nailed him. <laughs> you have the network, right? Yeah. Okay, they made this like documentary about uh, Monday Night Wars ECW versus WWE. It's like the only one that ECW has for the Monday Night Wars. Uh, they basically, oh. s after ECW invaded WWE, that's when they introduced the whole chair hitting and. Uh, table smashing gimmicks oh after like 97 yeah right like right after the invasion yeah so paul was pissed because they, they were stealing hardcore matches and that's what built the attitude era and then mcmahon bought oh, yeah. the company they, they stole uh not just Which is, like I, I think it was fucked up it was you know what though it really is they made business. it work though it was business and, and paul Heyman got a good piece of that business though yeah he still um, is they really did work together, so. It, but at the same time, yeah, WWE ripped off not only ideas but complete storylines. Yeah. So it's the way it is. The bigger, you know, if it wasn't for that though, it wouldn't be what it is today. I mean, it, it ECW was not as big as WWF, and nobody will ever like. You can say it was better wrestling, whatever, but it it just wasn't as big. Yeah. Uh, so you have to have that big. We wouldn't have Stone Cold. The big font, the companies, and yeah, you, you have to have that. I get it. It it just sucks that. Uh, I don't know. I wish it did though. What? Like they, they had a bigger company. They had TNT, I think. Well, you and know what's crazy? It took me a while. Like back then, I knew ECW was around. I knew WCW was around. I cared about WWF, and that was it. Like now, WCW looked faker. It looked too fake. Um, it looked like a bunch of hat, like, I don't know, it, it didn't, <laughs> it didn't look right to me. It, it, it was like, oh, these guys are all old guys that have been around and you know what I mean? They use a lot of old guys. Yeah. And then ECW, I didn't have the appreciation for the wrestling back then. It was about the, oh, I want the big stage, you know? Yeah. It was, it was like, oh, of, it was just a bunch of spot fests. Well, it looked to me like, oh, this is done in a garage. <laughs> like it, it didn't look like you know what I mean it looked grungy which now yeah. I would love that but then back when I was a kid I was like oh, no you know what I mean this just, just looks like shit what is this oh dude then have you have you checked out Lucha Underground everyone's telling me about it I, you would love that man I, That's I what think people are saying. I mean I'm not the biggest wrestling enthusiast but if it's good shit like I'll watch it oh dude that's what yeah, people I, are saying. I, Everyone's telling me, Lucha, Lucha, Lucha. <laughs> I like it better than, uh, well, I can't say better than the WWE product now, but, like, once the Sting thing is over and once uh, we know who the, the Rumble winner is and the champion settled, I think Lucha is, like, going to be the better product. What do it's you better what, than... Okay. No, no, you... you... Well, what, what is your comparison between, like, the Lucha Underground and, uh, like, ROH? Yeah, the, the thing is... Uh, I think it's better than RH and even TNA being the big company that TNA is uh, because 
every every wrestler has a character that's very vivid. Yeah. Uh, a lot of people don't understand the fact that it's, it's lucha. It's not just all Mexicans. They have like uh, they have the black people. They have the white people. They have the Asians. They have uh people that don't even wear wrestling masks in a luchador, uh type show. So the fact that they have different characters separates them. And the move they do is like phenomenal as well. So it's like, it's, I guess you could compare it to a Ring of Honor, but the storytelling's amazing. Okay. And, and if you see it, I can't explain it, but the promos, they, they look like movies, dude. If you ever get the chance, go online and look up the first episode. But uh, Chavo Guerrero's in it. He had a horrible match. <laughs> That's the only like only bad match they had, but uh, <laughs> John Morrison is in it and uh, Ezekiel Jackson, mm -hmm. a bunch of new guys. You'll be introduced. There's this guy named Prince Puma. I think he's gonna be in NXT very soon. Keep an eye for uh, Prince Puma. But, yeah, uh, I probably have a name change. Oh yeah. <laughs> no, I'll be checking that out though, because everyone's been telling me a little bit about it. I just haven't. It's had on time. YouTube. I think it's on. Yeah, it's on. It's on YouTube. Not the latest episodes, but they have episodes. It's it's in the, it's in like a little uh, studio set. It reminds me of oh, ECW okay. a little bit. Okay. And right on. It has a cinema look, so uh, the camera the cameras are different, the promos are different, and. Uh, they even have a fucking mariachi band in the beginning, which is weird. <laughs> There's even a fucking mariachi band. It's yeah. Insane. It's, it's fucking amazing. That's would you amazing. look at this? Oh my god, Andy, they got a mariachi band. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's recorded someplace uh, around Los Angeles. Or Boise These are real Mexicans here, Edith. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh. I could send you a link, I think. Do you want to do that? Yeah, go ahead, man. Okay. Do I have you add on my Skype? Uh, maybe not. Is you? Are you Sam Crow? Yeah. yeah. Do I have Sam you? Crow. There we go. Just a guy. Just a guy. What the fuck? My comment says Joe. What the fuck? Joe. I didn't even put that. It was, uh... Pew, 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 pew. There you go. Okay, let me see. I know this website, uh... You can see, uh, full wrestling events. You want that? Are you using a goddamn banana as a phone? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just making sure, you know. Whenever I can't watch wrestling on, on a network or anything, I use uh, this website called wrestling dot, uh, watchwrestling.ch. Oh, okay. I've so, used that. Uh, there you go. You can watch it on your phone. That's how I use it. Oh, right on. I haven't done that. Uh, let me see. Lucha. Uh, the last episode. What's today? Today is Monday? Okay, so this is the latest episode. I'm Holy shit, little... this is a really good website. Yeah, man. There's Jesus, a... they got the whole fucking network on don't, there. Don't tell anybody, alright? <laughs> <laughs> don't tell anybody, alright? Right. I'm, I'm going to send, send you the latest episode of Lucha. I think it's one of the best ones. Boom, whenever you're free. All or right. bored as fuck, or drunk, or whatever. Uh, uh, it, it says uh, 404, you're fucked. <laughs> it says that. Yeah, it says. Uh, it says it's no. Right, there's right. nothing there. Wait, which one? That second link, the PW talk. Oh, okay. Then I'll send. Uh... Yeah, it said it's no good. Here, click on that, and then click on Daily Motion. Daily Motion is always the HD one that works. There we go. Here we go. Okay. This is Destiny Homes. Alberto just signed with them. Destiny. Destiny. Yeah. They're getting more views than Ring of Honor. Oh, I can download this. Cool. Ooh. 
That's how. This is how I saw. Uh, what the fuck is that called? New Japan. Because I can't see it over here. They don't show it on TV or anything. I have to watch it through here. Did you uh, see it? Did what? you see that New Japan WrestleMania thing? Nah. Oh, okay. What? If, oh, New Japan? Yeah, because everybody's talking about that. The the WrestleMania they had. No. It's I've a, totally been out of it. <laughs> Wrestle Kingdom, I think it's called. Oh, okay. Wrestle, like, uh, Kingdom 9. Yeah, Joe, yeah, yeah, yeah. Joe was, uh, do, like, hyping it up. Yeah. I, see, I've heard a lot lately. This from is how I watch it, because they don't show it on TV or any websites. This is the only one. Oh, no. They, this fucking site is good. Yeah. It's, uh, comes in handy. No, really. Like, it's got, uh, it's got good quality. And it's got all the shit that you'd want to see. Like yeah, if you didn't have the day up, after it you know? comes out, it comes out a day after. Okay. I think Raw's up. Let me see. Yeah, they do have Raw. Up, I think. Yeah, as soon as people can can upload it, it'll be up. Like, yeah, it's up. <laughs> That's crazy. It's already up with one hundred and thirty-seven thousand. Jesus. Views. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Well, that's a, that's actually a really high rated one because, like, there's one from November 2014. It it just now has half a million views. The fucking one from tonight will have half a million views by next week. Damn. <laughs> because of you know the sting and uh, sting and all that shit. Sting. I mean, hey, you know, sting. He's not even gonna be there. <laughs> that son of a bitch. You can't cut a promo for shit. Son of a bitch messed up his makeup. <laughs> I yeah, I don't even know what's going. I've yet to see what's going on. I just I hear he doesn't have the right music or anything, so I'm like fuck. Oh god. I mean, fuck I, you, Sting. I hate you, Sting. I don't know. I don't care either way because I wasn't a WCW guy, so I really. It doesn't give me, like, any feelings of nostalgia. It doesn't give me anything. Like, Dave and them are coming in their pants, but... Yeah, because it's, all he did was fucking look into the camera at his face, like... Eh. He looked into out of space, and they showed him on camera. And then the <laughs> crowd popped. Yeah, I mean, I get it. It's cool, but it's... I don't know. It's weird, because... It's nostalgia. It's not a um. It's 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 not currently going like happening. It's not a big deal right now. You know? Yeah. It's it's like if Stone Cold came out in ten more years. Yeah, we love Stone Cold, but we where's something new? Where, where's the next big deal? You know? <laughs> I don't know. In a way, I'm kind of the bitchy guy who wants it to be as good as it used to be, but I don't want the same old shit either. I mean, we have the fucking New Age Outlaws in a match. Why? Oh, yeah. I remember. I love me some New Age Outlaws, but man, I don't think... I don't know if they can go like they used to go, and... I don't know. I think they... Uh, I mean, they're not as good as they were, but they could wrestle. Yeah, they still can wrestle. I mean, they last time they had a couple matches, they won bad. They won the belt. Yeah, that the... Uh, last year, actually. Yeah, uh, Royal Rumble. Billy Gunn. Nice Billy Gunn shit. busted his his mouth or something. He was bleeding from the mouth. Mm -hmm. I don't know what the fuck. No, happened. no, the butthole. The butthole. Yeah. Wait, what? <laughs> the butthole. No, that's X Pac. <laughs> Are you serious? Yeah. The, what the fuck was the thing with the butthole? No, yeah, no, yeah. That was probably yeah. on Raw. No, wait a minute. You do, you knew with... you know X Pac ripped his ass. Oh, all, I right? know that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I remember he did. So yeah, Steve, I uh, I tore my rectum. And no, uh, he did. I remember. He did with the Bronco Buster. The Bronco Buster did a seal thing in an indie show, but uh, oh, there was God. a segment on Raw uh, with. Uh, Billy Gunn, he took laxatives. Oh. So he had to rush out. Uh, hey, right after he won the match. I got. Uh, sorry, dog. I gotta take a shit. 
Yeah, we got two words for you. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> it's one. Holy word. shit. <laughs> there you go. There you go. I got a poo. If you want to see uh, this graphic I made for Joe, he hasn't showed anybody yeah. yet. Sure. Uh, where's... Oh, shit. Did you already make him a Royal Rumble one? Uh, yeah, I did make him. I'll show you that one. You get to see it before anyone. But that's the belt. Oh, that's shit. That's like the new logo. We were talking about that, actually, about how, like, if we could get, like, a JCS logo with the red underneath it, like the old... Yeah, school. that's that's what I did. I heard you guys. Yeah, that's what we need, man. That That's cool. Okay, cool. Damn, dude, you got all his fucking shit ready to go. YouTube, Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, the whole bit. Yep. Jesus. Yeah, if you need any graphics or anything for a social network you got, let me know, man. Yeah, yeah. I, you, you know, can you get laid with these? No, shit. <laughs> no, I think you can. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Just get, you make a business no, chat. Girls, girls like edits. Girls <laughs> like uh, photo edits. They'll like. Can I? Can I edit their mouth? <laughs> <laughs> oh like, shit! Talk now. Okay, talk stop now. now. Talk now. You know my uh, my my mother Helen. She was a real bitch. She never, she never, uh, she never put the, <laughs> she, she never put her the presents in her stockings. <laughs> Some bitch, she always uh, she put coal. She was a real she bitch. Always, my dad, she, he was screwing around on her for years. My brother Owen, he was adopted by um, <laughs> a family of uh, hippies in Saskatchewan. Saskatchewan. Um, why doesn't this open? <laughs> That's not the first time I heard that. <laughs> <laughs> Why won't this open? Yeah, I will. Uh, Why won't it close? How about that? <laughs> oh, shit. It's always open. It's always open for business like the whore you are. I don't know what I'm talking Linda. about. Linda? Uh, I think this, uh, I want a divorce. Uh, you see, Linda, I've been uh, trying to tell you that, uh, <laughs> some some serious has happened and uh I've ate <laughs> <laughs> Dude you see your Vince isn't that that's not bad at all. Thank you. Like what what let me think. That was good and then what was the other one you did? Oh the movie guy. <laughs> Those two were like pretty good, man. I can't even do it because I'm laughing right now. <laughs> uh, let me let me tell you something, uh, Linda. You're gonna have to strap it on tonight. I've been meaning to tell you this, uh <laughs> for a while. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Oh, thank you. oh God, John, I'm gonna, need, I'm gonna need you to. I'm gonna need you to. We're gonna. We're gonna need to make a wish, kid, tonight. <laughs> he's gonna pull out a gun. He's gonna. He's gonna pull his pubes. <laughs> no, he's okay, gonna. So. You know, see, when you went into the, the deep Vince right there, it didn't work. But when you just did the normal, like, hey, bro, so, uh, that worked. <laughs> that's like the, the confrontation Vince. <laughs> yeah, like the real the real quiet, like, hey. Uh, that's like a, like, like if you if he meets a Make-A-Wish kid. So, yeah, uh, yeah. So. <laughs> so I heard you have cancer. Real bummer. Uh, you, you're probably going to die. <laughs> How about a, um, you want a wristband? <laughs> Go see, uh, never give up. <laughs> I, wish I, had, I wish I had my own fucking show, oh my god. Yeah, Joe should be recording this. Holy thing. shit. <laughs> dumb, bastard, dumb bastard. He's listening. I know you're listening, you fucker. He's probably asleep. Like, Leah. Leah. Oh, yeah. can, can, can and then when he wakes up, he's going to be like, oh, oh, what the fuck? No, Six like, hour call. For real, if I was him, I would have put this on record and not told anybody. Oh, I, I mean, I can put a record on my computer, but I'll have to, like, switch it out and everything. Have to, uh, you, have to, you have to make sure the copyright is uh, oh not infringed. Infringed copyright. So, uh... <laughs> well, they'll all infringe on your anus. 
Uh, so, uh, I've, I've heard you, uh, you got cancer. Uh, <laughs> that sucks, huh? And <laughs> 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 it sucks. But, yeah. So, uh, <laughs> get a little herpes, uh. <laughs> then, waits like five minutes, just staring at his eyes, like uh, uh, he got a kind of feel. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, so uh, they uh, he he been doing the chemo. <laughs> he, he's gonna puke. He's gonna puke. No, he's that's gonna that's puke. Fucked that's fucked up. Uh. Uh. <laughs> who, uh, who, who pissed in your lucky charms, pal? <laughs> uh, oh shit! So, uh, um, <laughs> real tough luck you got there. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> don't don't be <laughs> What's that blood disease? <laughs> <laughs> what blood disease? Is it fucking what, Ebola? What's it called? No, what's it called? It starts with an L, right? Uh, blood, 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 blood. Uh, I don't know. Blood. Uh, it's uh, the one, yeah, like kids get it, everyone gets it. You can get it. Not what? little. Swine flu? No, it's a fucking blood issue. What the fuck is it? Like blood cancer. Uh, scalpel. Fuck face. Fuck. <laughs> Hang on. Google. So, so uh. Oh my God. Type two diabetes. There, uh. there really is a blood cancer. No. I, mean, I think so. <laughs> oh, there is. Uh oh, CSI Miami. What will happen next? Yeah! Man, dun, dun. Uh, but, but there was another name for it. So, uh, type two diabetes. Uh, you got a hematoma? <laughs> uh, I guess you won't be needing these uh, fruity pebbles. You didn't kick out, John. You always kick out. Yeah, uh, Linda. I've been mean to tell you this. Uh, Uh, oh, there, it, there it is. There it is. So, uh, you got leukemia. Leukemia. That's the one. Oh, uh, you've got leukemia, I've heard. Uh, how's it going? <laughs> Sounds like, uh, pretty rare. <laughs> Sounds like, uh, hell is a thing to live with, uh, what do you like, Sounds a restaurant? Like hell of a gimmick. No. <laughs> Sounds like a hell of a gimmick. Uh. <laughs> Yo, that's fucked up. Yeah, you know, Cena can cure this. <laughs> Throw off the power of uh, all of his t-shirts. There is penis upon your forehead. As long as you buy every t-shirt, uh, you're fine. Right. No, twenty dollars a piece. That's only twenty dollars. Don't worry. Nine nine ninety nine will cure it all. The three the three numbers in the back of your parents with credit card, yes. Uh, the, yeah, yeah, I did that tonight with uh, <laughs> Tony. <laughs> <laughs> Tony was on. You just get your mother's credit card and uh, you let your fingers. <laughs> That's my favorite, my favorite accent. That right there. What do you call that? Uh, Tommy C. Yeah. Well, it's um, it's it's a Jersey thing, really. It's a, it's like a Jersey thing. It, it, it's like uh, forget um, about it. Yeah. I don't know if you've seen that one broad, uh, Snooky, the fucking yeah okay. uh, boyfriend, that fucking guy. Yeah. This guy, you know what? Uh, you the get a, situation. You get a piece of uh, pe pepperoni and the salami. <laughs> and the she, uh, make your cake. We'll fuck you up with a piece of my pepperoni. Mm -hmm. I'm just situation. Jim Tan Laundry. <laughs> I look like an overgrown Oompa Loompa. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he does. <laughs> they all do. <laughs> so, uh... God, Flo is a whore. So, uh, you're from Jersey, huh? Yeah, a lot of butts. Yeah, uh, I'm sorry to say you won't be making it to NXT, huh? 
Tommy would have laughed his ass off at that. Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. How do you do Triple H? What? Triple H. Uh, you know, uh... <clears throat> uh, yeah, let me... My think. nose is bigger than my cock. You know, uh... <clears throat> Stephanie... You never tap out. <laughs> I don't... I See, I don't know, like... It, Joe can do him pretty good, actually. Joe could do a, a lot of voices. Joe, like Joe can do Dallas if you give him enough cock. <laughs> right? <laughs> uh, no, um... Triple Typical H. Americans. <laughs> I don't know what that was, but that was I funny. I don't fucking know what it was. <laughs> I don't even know who it was. <laughs> typical American, yeah. You're done a typical American, see, I'll shoot him up right now. Well, I tell you what, I love that guy, that Brad Hardy always comes out here with his uh, shenanigans. <laughs> Brad has know. purple glasses. I, I like that, Brad. You know, but the funny thing is, if I hadn't watched, like like I told you earlier, if I didn't watch the Attitude Era, like when I was, um, when I was way younger, I fucking started watching like 98, so that would have made me like... 10 years old so at that point i went back and watched like you know brett knowing you know wrestlemania 10 i went and watched the old stuff yeah but if i'd have watched that old stuff without seeing stone cold and all that other shit i would have just thought it was stupid and moved right on <laughs> it, it it's you know it's just weird like i look at it now and i don't even think twice about it like oh that's badass Bret hart you know this and that but man if, if i didn't have the knowledge i do like i would just think it was ridiculous not only are they wearing pink, but the fucking guys all, you know, they're not hitting each other. <laughs> I don't know, like, it's like the Ascension. Immediately, it takes me out of it the way they're dressed. Not be not really because it's the Road Warriors, but because that shit just doesn't work. We're better than the Road Warriors. I, did, I, I like the Road Warriors, but, man, that's because they were some hard-ass motherfuckers, though. Are the Road Warriors the ones with uh, Animal and Hawk? Yeah. Then what the fuck they're saying they're better than them, the fucking piece of shit. Right. They only had, they've had two matches, all right? Well, it was, a, it was actually, some people disliked it. I didn't mind, because I thought it was a good way to get heat, but. The thing is, people think they're good, but they weren't good in, in uh, NXT, in my opinion, because they had, they were against good uh, opponents. They sold the matches to their. To I don't their think rows. they're all that good, and I don't think in, I don't think a lot of people. I think a lot of people who know what they're talking about would say they're not good. It's just it's working because people are Apparently. stupid. I mean, they're facing the fucking uh, DX on Sunday. DX? Oh, DX. the goddamn the fucking okay. New Age Outlaws. Yeah. Yeah. See, like that's ridiculous. Like it's just another squash match. They're going to put them over. Maybe. And, Not well, squash. you know, D DX isn't going to win. I know that idea. Yeah. And, and you know, D I mean, I'd be, I don't know. It's going to be ridiculous. They fucking, I don't even care. Jesus. I think uh, the the guy without the beard, he's a great single uh, contender. He could fucking wrestle. The guy without the beard. The one with the beard can't wrestle. I don't know who's who. I know. You'll, you'll find out. The guy with the beard sucks dick. That's all. <laughs> he has like a little shit shih tzu mustache. Yeah, I, I shit. You know the fucking lead, like uh, what's it called, the uh, Road Warriors? That I mean, that barely. Uh, you know, it worked. It worked back then. But man, it, you can't do that kind of shit anymore. It just doesn't work. What? That we're better than them? No, but more like just the gimmick itself, like having. Guys come out like that. It doesn't work. I don't know. Like, it doesn't work for me. That's for fucking sure. Like, it, I mean, I don't... How can kids even believe that shit? That's the thing. We're in a... Oh, fuck. We're, we're like in an era that uh, entrances aren't as as they used to be. Like, if, you, if you've seen uh, Finn Balor, have you seen anything of him? Like, any no, match I've at heard all? about him. Heard about oh, him. Oh, man, that fucking dude... Not only he could wrestle, his entrance is probably one of the best entrances I've seen, like the, the past five years. Wait, wait, all right. So better than Bray Wyatt? Better than oh, fucking ten times better than Bray Wyatt. Bray Wyatt's is pretty good. Okay. Yeah, and uh, mm. it, it it's like a rock, 
and then it switches to orchestra, and then the lights go to what he's doing as he's coming down the ramp. Uh huh. So, uh, but Finn, he could wrestle. He's hard kicking. He has a Japanese style type of fighting. And uh, he has I've heard experience. a lot about him. I I've been meaning to catch check him out because I've I've actually seen like uh, speaking of the music, I've seen like some people. But he has mean, face paint. He has like well, this face paint. I've seen people doing covers of his music, so it must be good. Oh, I didn't know that. I'll check that out. Yo, well, there's this guy that does like all the fucking. Uh, he does like guitar covers for all the fucking music. I saw uh, Jim. Uh, fuck, what's this? Jim Johnson? Is that no, no, th- no. This guy's just like some guy on YouTube. Oh, okay. And he he does like. He even does like um the Wyatt's music, but he and he does it wearing the sheep mask. <laughs> it's fucking funny, but he does pretty good. Like he in uh, one of his most recent ones is the Finn Balor uh, theme. Mm. That's pretty cool. And from what you and I haven't heard it, but from what you just told me, like it's probably a good theme. And he wears face paint, which is like an old school type thing, like what they're doing, uh, the Ascension. But it's like, more the, original, right? Yeah, he he had like a Venom type. Face paint, like a Marvel villain face paint. And it goes down to his arms. But uh, his presentation speaks out for the character. I think that's what the Ascension's lacking is presentation. They just walk down a ramp and uh, they take off their fucking attire. Uh, Finn doesn't do that. He expresses what he what he's using. And yeah. you could tell that by, by his uh, entrance, which is a huge factor to his character. And hopefully they don't they don't lose that because if he's already got that that's yeah. a big part his of his uh, gimmick is if it's if they take that away I'm a fucking uh, Vince uh, you're fired. <laughs> <laughs> and a prank call that'll be funny. If no, I was yeah, his fucking like, number. Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> no, <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> no, see, I wish Joe was here because fucking like you gotta work on that Vince because that's a pretty good Vince. Um, I know. And I was thinking the good I, Vince. So I you, you him, and him. Well, go ahead. Uh, I heard him saying that he wanted to do some type of call. This phone call that he was doing, just like the Seven Eleven one. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know, we could do that. Like he's. No, I could imagine like Vince calling Vince. You know. Uh. <laughs> hey Vince. Hey pal. <laughs> yeah, real real stinker tonight. It was real bad. <laughs> Well, uh, the Ascension. Oh, yeah, you like them, don't you? No. <laughs> <laughs> We've got a problem, Vince. Oh, I don't know. No, I don't I don't even know how it would go, but because you guys, it, it, you both do good Vince's, but they're a little different, so people would be able to tell, like, which one's which. Yeah. It, I think that would be fucking hilarious. <laughs> I don't know why. Can you tell them tell yeah. that for me? Next time what? you talk to him. Tell him that next time you get to talk no, to him. I, I, yeah, I just, as long as I don't forget. And even if I do, I'll remember because that's fucking hilarious. Like, uh, so, uh. <laughs> no, what I think, what I think uh, he should do is uh, what we're doing earlier with the fucking disease. Like, uh. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> fucking. Yeah, that sucks. <laughs> you, uh. You, yeah, you. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even fucking do it because just from thinking about it, I'm dying right now. <laughs> you don't want to die, pal. It's not. It's no fun. <laughs> I've heard it's a, uh, it's a way to go. You know, coward's way out. Leukemia. Uh, uh, keep your ashes in my ass. No. <laughs> <laughs> what the? Fuck? Oh my god. So uh. <laughs> uh breast cancer. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Can I check for lumps? <laughs> Some yeah. shit like that. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> that was good. That was good. And can I check for lumps? <laughs> Ooh, I think it's stage two coming on. <laughs> That's fucked up. <laughs> the best one was probably, uh... So, uh... <clears throat> So, uh, leukemia, uh, uh, that's very bad, uh, how's it going? Uh, See, you're losing, it. you're losing it. I know. 
Yeah, the wristband. <laughs> the fucking wristband, man. Wristband. How about a cup? <laughs> a Seven Eleven cup that they always have. <laughs> we got a yes. Uh, so we got these cups from Sonic. They gave us extra. This one has the Undertaker. Oh. Before the streak. <laughs> before and after. And they, these are cups from uh, WrestleMania 27. <laughs> they got the before They're and old, after but cups. Still good. <laughs> uh, before the streak. Uh, after the streak. <laughs> we wanted to give you the uh, the, bold, the the bug eyed black guy. No. <laughs> The fucking meme, the meme guy. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, we want to go. We, we, you know, the sign guy. Well, we're firing him. We, we got the meme guy. <laughs> he was hired. He's fired now, but yes, <laughs> he was fired. Now he's hired. Would you call this avocado? <laughs> I don't know. What <laughs> I asked for three avocados. There's only two here. <laughs> oh my god! Mandarins. Did I ask this, for mandarins? They're the same shit, damn it. Oranges, mandarins, cuties. Oh, they're the fine. same thing. <laughs> uh, Sign uh, guy, you're fired. So, uh. <laughs> Then he does that lip shit. <laughs> that lip shit. <laughs> <laughs> I just love how he does that lip shit again. Ah, uh, Linda. <laughs> I've been uh, meaning to tell you something. Uh... Your vagina smells. <laughs> then he fucking leaves on a motorcycle. Uh, I've been mean, telling you this for quite some time, and uh, I've ate. Good luck tomorrow. And uh, you do too, probably. Good, good luck in the election. <laughs> <laughs> I'm voting for Hillary. You son of a bitch! <laughs> I was like, I, uh, I just, you know, you're gonna do well, but um, I'm, I just, I'm voting for Hillary. He lost a lot of money to that, which is well, so fucked up. Oh, uh, trying to get her into politics. Yeah, when when they, she was running for president, I wish she would just run off a into a mirror. How about you run off a cliff? <laughs> I, you know, I I had this. Uh, I had the cleaning lady <laughs> clean. <laughs> I, I yeah. I, she, she, I try, I've been. Try, <laughs> I can read you. So, uh, I put a big wad of hundreds on the other side of the glass door. I was hoping she'd run through it and kill herself. <laughs> That's not like a long way to go for like a halfway okay joke. Oh my but god. This is a long setup. That's for funny. That was funny. Like the so, setup was I got a good one. <laughs> well. I can't do it. So, uh, Linda, I heard it. <laughs> <laughs> that lip, that shit you do. <laughs> Where are you getting that from? <laughs> what? Like, the, the, the lip smacking. I'm shit. doing that. Well, no, but what is, when does he do that? He, every time he fucking talks to Triple H. Every time. Oh no no no! What he when he used to do it? He used to do it. Um, every time he had a serious conversation when he was in the hospital with the Rock. Do so you remember that? I mean, not the Rock, the fucking Stone Cold. Do you remember no. that? No. <laughs> no, I don't. You mean when he hit him with the fucking bedpan? Yeah, but it was like way before, that, like when he first uh, they interviewed him in the hospital, and that's all he was up. To. Damn it, Mick. Uh, so, Linda, I've uh, heard you're running for president. How about you run off a cliff? <laughs> no, like, um, I could be Monica Lewinsky. <laughs> you have a penis, don't you? Uh, no. You're fired. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I uh I was looking to get some Cubans. They're in the truck. No, I don't know. <laughs> they're in his, they're in his. I fit forty five of them into a in uh, forty five of them into a jalopy. <laughs> jalopy. So, uh, with a flat tire. Stephanie, uh uh, this dad calling. This daddy. Uh, daddy. You're <laughs> I'm leaving another voicemail. Hopefully you're not sucking on Hunter's dick again. Don't want to walk into that one. Uh, anyways, I bought you a new jalopy. Uh, just pick it up whenever you're ready. Uh, the, the mechanic says it should run. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> <laughs> and then they yeah, exactly. that to, to Hunter, uh, go fuck yourself. <laughs> oh, yeah, and Hunter. Uh, go fuck yourself. <laughs> <laughs> like, he says it quietly. By the way, tell Hunter I said hi, and uh, go fuck yourself. You're like a... You almost are doing like a version between uh, Vince McMahon and Batman. I'm Batman. <laughs> I'm not wearing hockey pants. I can't do Batman. Do you guys? Or did you catch that uh, that After Dark that Joe and I did? Uh, which one? With Bane. Bane, Bane. I think I did. Yeah. Uh, I hand, did. Handicapped access is now banned. Oh yeah. <laughs> we'll if if you cannot walk or you're paraplegic, you will die. You will die. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Who's doing that? Uh, Joe, for the most part, and then I would try, I did some of it. Uh, he, I, I totally butchered the, uh, the, the uh, impersonation, but I came up with some of the really good lines. It was funny. Joe, Joe does a hell of a bane, though. I mean, why didn't they just put these stars there? Why the stars? They... No, it's great, because he, yeah, <laughs> well, tell him to fly. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah! Now I remember. That was hilarious. Yeah, uh, Why didn't they? Why, don't, why did they need these Don't stairs? The no, this is just... Bane high on the no. Playboy Mansion. All that started because Joe was talking about how he fucks with this uh, this handicap guy at work. <laughs> oh my god! Like, like he throws a penny on the ground and he's like, "Yeah, bet you wish you could pick that up." <laughs> <laughs> And he's and he goes yeah and he's Jewish so it's like double double hard. <laughs> yeah. Double hard. You cheap bastard! You can't even you can't even afford a pair of legs. <laughs> That's fucked up. Titanium alloy. Can't beat it. But I wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> 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 oh my god. I'm so fucked up, but I enjoy it. And life has, life has been fucked up to me, so I will fucking swing back with all I've got. Hey, batter, batter, hey, batter, batter, swing, batter. Hey, <laughs> lamb shit, he hits all the bases. <laughs> I miss lamb shit. Lamb shit. Lamb shit. Who was lamb shit? Oh, lamb shit? Lamb shit. Uh... He's like one of the first callers. His, his, yeah, his name's Ben Blanchett. But one night, uh, the, he had to make a new name for UStream one night, so he made his name Lamb Shit, and it worked. Oh, and who's who's Mister Big Ones? What the fuck Captain, is that? Captain, Captain Big Ones. Captain, Captain Big Ones. What the fuck's that shit? Oh shit! Well, it's Joe, but. He had not he he had me fooled. He had everyone fooled. And if it wasn't for me, we may have still had it. But he he had told this story about how uh, there's this guy that uh, he can't talk. He's a deaf mute, but he watches the show and he types in stuff. <laughs> and like I bought it. Everybody bought it. Like, oh, yeah. that sounds awesome. Yeah. And then one night, like I was talking to him, and he goes. And I'm like, you know, I like that Captain Big Ones. He's he's he seems like a nice guy. It's crazy how yeah, he just types, you know, he just he just says his shit, whatever. And Joe goes, no, you mean when I type the shit in? No, no, no. <laughs> you know, I, you know, I'm talking about big ones. He goes, 
No, I'm Captain Big Ones. Oh, he ruined it. <laughs> like, <laughs> that son of a bitch. He didn't realize, like, I fell for it so hard. <laughs> and and so many other people did, too. Like, I he, he, he got a comment in the chat that said, Fuck you, Joe. I fell for Captain Big Ones for over a year. Oh, my God. Tommy, everyone fell for it. It was so funny. He could have kept it going. But he, he, he let the cat out of the bag, but... It's kind of like his uh, secret identity. Oh, it was fucking great. Well, because, like, it was weird, because I, I believed it because um, the type of show Joe has. Like, I believed that he had this guy who had kind of had a fucked lot in life, can't talk, uh, you know, loner, fucking watches Joe's show, and it, I don't know, it made sense to me. Like, hey, there's this guy, he fucking... Uh, he gets it. I don't know. It made sense. It made sense. Hell, all of us are kind of the same, except we all can talk and shit, but we're, we all have our issues. But anyway, it turns out it was just Joe being a fuckhead. <laughs> and it's fucking hilarious. Oh, even guacamole. Oh, yeah, you know, Elizabeth, sometimes I uh, get a little stinky down there, a little guacamole. <laughs> I never did find that remote. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, I could never do a fucking mocker, man. Ow! Oh. Stinky, stinky. Pull the pinky. Yes, well, who's been eating all the cheese it's again? <laughs> Dude, that's really good. Was that's like spot on. Spot on! Spot on! From a point. Tell me how wax on, wax off. I'll wax your carrot. That's what I told my wife yesterday. I'll wax you on, and I'll wax you off. I'll, I'll jerk you off with... And, 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 <laughs> I'll, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll shave your testicles and put them in a blender. No, I if don't know. one falls off, don't worry, you have another two. Three. Four. No, no, one, two, three. Three. Oh, shit. It, nah. Joe's probably hanging from a rafter somewhere. I'm fucking on my computer right now. This one's for Joe if he's listening. Oh, God. Yeah, this is what 30-year-old guys listen to like myself. Hmm. Oh, look at the sunset in California. Like, this, like, what is this? Surfer guy music, huh? She said her name was Sally Sandy. <laughs> and we stole the Mike's hard lemonade out of the refrigerator. Your dad wasn't home. And then you, and then you kissed me, kissed me. So good. Now the best part is when it goes like a verse. Holy shit, yo. Joe goes into like this weird thirteen year old girl <laughs> thing he does. I imagine him like fucking jumping while he's singing that. <laughs> like, fuck this. Oh my god. <laughs> Dear D. Was... Oh shit. And then emo. Emo Joe. Yes. And take it in and out. <laughs> yes. I want to be inside of you. Yes. I want to inside of you yes i want to be inside of you yes i want to be inside of you sex me and sex me at night <laughs> my erection shows as i send you the invite hold you down tonight 
followed you down tonight. You are not my wife, followed you down tonight. You are not my wife, followed you down tonight. That's a pretty good song. Uh, yeah, he did a good job. It's, and it it's, a, it's a full cuff. three minutes, yo. Yeah, it's all off the cuff. You can't, you can't, uh, can't fuck with that. This <laughs> is doubling. I did that. The fucking his voice got higher. If you know. That. Yeah, I was gonna say you should. You, you almost went Tommy C there. <laughs> no, you know what's funny? Like, um, I I played Tommy C on YouTube. And yeah. then I put it on like times two, and he goes, Oh, yeah, yeah. And, and then he was like, How do yeah, you did that? You should uh, make a clip with him like that, where it just goes, He starts going on a rant, like, Oh, let me tell you something. And this other guy, he came in and, <laughs> and it just keeps getting faster and faster and faster until the fucking tape just blows up. <laughs> okay, where is it at? Oh, I don't know. Like, we, we should make something like that. Is that you right there? <laughs> yeah. You can't. Listen. I'm faster. You are not my wife, but I'll make you come. You can't sing, you dumb bastard. <laughs> I'll make you come. <laughs> I will make you <laughs> He's not like a fucking Transformer. <laughs> I will make your cop. <laughs> I told him, put him on iTunes. He hasn't put it on iTunes, that son of a bitch. Not even iTunes, just the podcast. It's fucking hilarious. Uh, that's good shit. Hold you down. Oh, man. Mayonnaise. 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 Yeah, my brother, he gave me mayonnaise one time. It wasn't mayonnaise, though. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> it's the last damn time I ever slept around him. Holy shit. I always keep one eye open. One eye on him and the other eye on my pecker. Yo, when are you free, man? We have to... I want to record, like, a, a short no, show. You know, here. I'm not black, so I've been free since I was born. Happy Martin Luther King's Day. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> no, when are you free? Honestly, like, uh, I'm, you know... I'm even when I'm busy, like I'm still free all the time. Like I, I'm always home. So. Oh man. Yeah, yeah I can't work. So. <sighs> Shit. You could be a a co-host. Cause I'm thinking about doing like a wrestling uh show. You want to co-host like, the suicide? Yeah. Now. One eight hundred. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> well, I mean, you know what's funny? Everyone's everyone's trying to do their own shows, which I get that. Um. It's funny though because we're all part of the uh, the Joe Cronin show thing and yeah. like Dave Rose he's trying to do his own thing and like it, it's there's nothing wrong with that but it's like hmm I feel I feel like everybody can be used in the in a, I don't know in the Joe Cronin show uh, platform but what kind of show are you thinking of Oh mine is not like a talk show mine is uh, gameplays but it's with commentary built oh, over the gameplays Oh 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 Gotcha. So I do like 2K15, but I don't got it yet. I'm, I gotta get a PS4 or an Xbox One. I'm not sure. Well, shit, isn't it on? Oh, yeah, I was gonna say, isn't that game on PlayStation? Uh, 3? It is, but it's uh, it's so fucking different, man. Mm. I got a PS3. Isn't the playability gonna be better on the PS3? No. Uh. Not at all. 
Because I thought the next gen thing was a problem. Uh, the, the thing they have for PS3 is the same thing as PS. I mean, the same thing as 2K14. It's like nothing updated at all. Uh, which oh. is fucked up because they got new options for next generation PS4. They got new options, new game types, new graphics, uh, new moves. Every move is recorded differently, so it's a completely different game. Wow. So, uh, That's fucked up. Yeah, they fucked up. What the fuck is next <laughs> gen? <laughs> oh, shit. Next gen is uh, PS4, Xbox One. No, I got you. I was... I was... <laughs> I was show, uh, thing. What you remember that video? Yeah, I remember. <laughs> fuck. What the fuck? Yeah, I don't know what to say next time I, I join the call. You can you can start in with the uh, hey pal. So uh, hey pal. Uh, so I I heard your uh, your daughter uh, ate ate a lot of marker. <laughs> ate <laughs> what? Her marker? <laughs> She's been eating highlighters. So uh, need any extra purple highlighters? Huh? <laughs> oh, uh, Stephanie used to eat a lot of uh, highlighters all the time. She uh, in the dark dicks. She ate a lot of stuff, if you know what I mean. Yeah. Daddy had a present one night, and uh, <laughs> oh, that's fucked up. <laughs> oh my god! I stuffed, I stuffed their stuff. And then know? he like answers the call right now, like you son of a bitch. How did you know? <laughs> you remember that goddamn? I don't know if you were watching or not, but <laughs> when um. Undertaker was supposed to be like going after Stephanie, and uh, he fucking burns the teddy bear. Yeah, I remember that. Like, Vince is like, uh, he's wasn't just a SmackDown or some shit. Yeah, it was Raw or SmackDown, but it's just fucking funny. What does that mean? What that bear is burning, and uh, and Vince, and what is what is it? His soul. Damn it! <laughs> I love Jr. Man, he could sell you. My anything. God, he's broken in half. Son of a bitch! <laughs> He's got a family. No, that that's like some of my favorite shit of his. Is like, like son, son of a, a bitch. <laughs> yeah, like son of a bitch. I don't believe it. <laughs> so cold. That's, that's what you have to do. Like after something, he's like, son of a bitch. I can't believe it. It's gotta it, be like, Kane. He he makes you believe. Like that guy could call. Anything like he could call a fucking uh somebody duck. taking a shit and be like, oh, it's, it, he's, he's pinched the loaf, Michael. No, no, for real, Jr. could call anything. That guy's the man. I mean, Sam, I am green eggs and ham. Hell, Michael, I never like green. Hell, I never like you either, Michael. Michael, Michael. They should have never taken the umbilical cord from around your throat, Michael. <laughs> Jesus. Right, right? Oh my god. I swear to god, Michael, if I was your dad, I would have pulled out. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> and that's two fucking zing. Holy shit. Remember that one. Write that one down. Right now, man. Write that one down. Like whenever I do a joke, I think, well that make would that make Tommy laugh? <laughs> if I can hear his laugh. Like the fucked up shit. Work. Yeah, well, it was, wasn't it? <laughs> I would have taken your mother, I would have taken the uterus. I would have I'll fuck you, whole family, mate. Oh my god. Listen here, lassie. I'll fuck yeah, you up with a blender, mate. Jesus. I'm going to put your ovaries in a blender. Oh, and feed them to you. He's my destiny. Your destiny is to uh, clean up. <laughs> <laughs> your destiny, uh, I, uh, I just want to prank you. Uh, your destiny is to take out, take out the trash. <laughs> and um, sweep, sweep, a lot, sweep a lot. Oh shit! Don't forget Tell to me. bust the trays. <laughs> you fucking kill me. <laughs> Empty the trays, <laughs> and don't forget to make punch. Oh my god, the you're the funniest person ever, pay, pay, Make a pa pack of lunch. <laughs> we don't want any, uh, none of that, uh, no beans. 
Last time, last time. Oh, shit. Last time. <laughs> oh. Shane, what are you doing here? I'll oh, take you, Pop. I'm here to... Oh, uh, you, know, his, his, you know, Shane was fucking I'll fine. tell you, Pop. Oh, bang, I'll kick, I'll kick your ass. <laughs> I'll do the Hosho bang by myself. I, I miss Shane, dude. That kid was crazy. He's in Japan doing some shit. I don't know. He's probably fucking Japanese bitches. Fucking Japanese bitches. Yeah. Here comes the pussy. <laughs> he love you sometimes. You <laughs> 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 just had a car. <laughs> Fuck you. You, you tell me you we go to pick five, you fuckhead. Holy shit. This is Panda Express. I don't like it here. Yo, you ever had that shit? Hell yeah. Oh, I love Panda Express. They don't got any yeah. over here. They just opened one in, in this town here. Lucky bastard. Probably the best thing in this town now. <laughs> For real, oh, like, man. we don't have shit. Like, That's we have all like... I ate when I went to Florida. They have it a lot over there. Holy mashukana. You ever eaten a panda? They're fucking... The fucking serving panda food, panda meat. We know it's a delicacy in Canada. We eat their, uh, we eat their soul <laughs> with a little bit of, uh, you know, Worcestershire sauce. A little bit of sriracha, and it's all good. Right? Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna make you the next, uh, the sriracha kid. The sriracha kid. Oh god, that's fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna the Tabasco god. Oh my god, who's Tim? We're gonna, name, we're gonna call you El Tapatio. <laughs> and you know what's gotta be your... You know what's gotta be your theme song. Tapa 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 <laughs> Or was it? Kama 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 camellia. Some, some, some fucking Spanish song. You know any Spanish songs? Uh... No. <laughs> I'll give you one. Oh god. <laughs> Smells like Colgate. <laughs> Yo, where did you come from? Uh, not where you come from. The womb. Where have you, uh. <laughs> Fuck, that joke well, yeah. you said. The joke you said with uh, Alberto. It's, uh, it's my it's destiny, my destiny. To pick up trash. Um, community service Holy is my shit. longing. How do you remember that shit? I couldn't even do that spot on. I had to pick up gum from under the desk. <laughs> uh, Scrape the gum the under bosses. the desks. He told me to pick the gum from under his shoes. Shine their shoes. Right. Watch their children. And make sure their food doesn't have any poison. I was watching Chris Benoit's children. I fucked up, though. Oh, fuck. I fell asleep on the job just so yeah, fell asleep. I fell asleep on the <laughs> <laughs> God. Oh, <man. laughs> oh. Hey, you dumb bastard. Uh, no, the, Michael. You know, they, I, I just slid it in there. Uh, that's what she said. Um, and, uh... <laughs> what did I say? Oh my god. Oh yeah. Oh, that was a great match with Benoit. Yeah, and then after that he killed his family. It was fucking insane. Oh yeah, yeah. And then they're like, uh, wow, we didn't know he was a murderer until you brought that up. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm here for. <laughs> <laughs> the important tidbits. Important. He, You know, the, the thing about Benoit, though, is, you know, no matter what he did, he did wear his seatbelt, Owen. <laughs> oh shit. God, dude, these are like on fire, fucked up jokes. And we're just <laughs> fucking on a roll. Monetize this. They were, those were like we'll some call it, jokes. Joe would never get anybody our on the show. show would be called, uh, Go Fuck Yourself with a Blowtorch our, our Live. Our show would probably be called, like, Assholes Who Deserve to Die. Uh, because we're <laughs> fucked up for even... A uh, very long, let's make it, like, very long title. You know, like, like that guy's fucking screen name tonight? V VCR from a third dimension in space, whatever his fucking name was. Yeah. His like, fucking password is, is like a book. The fucking whole Harry Potter series. Eight to 25 characters. Well, hell, I'm going to use all 25 characters then. <laughs> fucking. 
You think Chris? So uh, you think Chris Benoit? You uh, you think he really used the cross face on him? No. <laughs> God, that's fucked up. Poor Chris. No, I, I see. I feel bad about it. Like I don't even. Uh, I'd rather make a joke about it because it, it's not funny, but it is. Because I don't know. It isn't. It isn't funny. It isn't, uh, but it is. I'd My phone's gonna die. A, I don't know. I well, I. Eh. I, I get too fucking sad about it, so I decided to make a joke of it. What the Benoit thing? Or any of it? Like uh, when I when I see something sad on the news or any of that, I'll make a joke immediately. And it's not like I don't care. It's like, well, I actually care a lot. That's why I make a joke. Otherwise, I don't even want to think about it. Well, it's, Eddie. it's, you know, Eddie. Mm-hmm. Man, let me tell you something. I, I I got the wrong shit, man. What? Well, he died from drugs, right? <laughs> I got the wrong bag, eh? He told me it was some other shit. Too late now. A heart attack. Yeah, he gave me the wrong shit. <laughs> <laughs> I asked for the downers, man. He gave me the uppers. <laughs> no, you know what's funny? Like, I can do Eddie, so I, I should probably start doing him. Eddie's I, just like every other freaking Hispanic wrestler. And let me tell you, you want an Eddie impression, you're gonna get it, man. Do you sound just like Alberto? Really? Alberto? Yeah, yeah like how... <laughs> Destiny, where are you? Well, what's his uh, What's his little guy's name? Um, I have your child. Oh, my oh God. Uh, Ricardo. Ricardo. You know, R- Ricardo, he, he always come to me, he says... Let me give some Kool-Aid. I tell him, go fuck yourself. You drank it all last time. <laughs> Make your own, fucker. Oh, shit. This is Splenda. It's not even sugar, eh? Yeah. How am I gonna make... How am I gonna make authentic Kool-Aid with the fucking Splenda? The fuck is Splenda, Essie? The fuck is Splenda? Yeah, what the fuck? Sweet and low. <laughs> I I love that Royal Rumble where Ricardo came out instead of Alberta, and he's what got the fucked up. Like I don't was it Royal Rumble two thousand twelve? Is it when uh, Alberta won? No, it's when Alberta. Oh, I'm sorry. No, it was the year after that. I think when when Alberto's music hit and Ricardo came out, and he oh, came out in the fucking shitty car and the fucked up towel around his neck and everything. The fucked up towel. Yeah, it was all fucking, like, yellow-stained and shit. Look like it is my up. abuelas. <laughs> you don't know. No. He licks my boots. He he sucks. <laughs> he sucks from the teat of Alberto de Rio. Straight the hairy the teat. The hairy teat. He cooks raw con pollo like no one's ever cooked before. <laughs> And his chorizo is the best. Don't get me started on this. And I'm not talking about the food with the tortilla. I'm talking about his cock, is he? Talking about his dick? (laughs) You know, you're going to have to put that away when we go live, right? (laughs) Stop. We're on the USA Network, pal. We we can't have any testicle. Testicles. Uh, Testicles. Sean, uh, you're fired. Sean, we're gonna need you to do. We're gonna need the boy toy back. The yes. boy toy. Uh, last time you were here, you uh, you forgot your penis. I kept it. I kept it in a jar. It's yeah, I was gonna say a little jar with a couple of ice cubes. Um, and mal- marmalade. I even put some marshmallows there, just for. <laughs> Just for seasoning. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's, uh, it's, it's rather, it's a bit steamy in here. Have you been, like... uh, <laughs> have, you, have you been taking a schwitz? Uh, I, I some sausage. <laughs> it's getting a little hot in here. Man, we're gonna bring back Doink. <laughs> we need him. We need him. Doink's gonna carry the company. <laughs> Macho man for Hall of Fame. Or like, Macho Man, go fuck yourself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's like Macho Man for Hall of Fame. Well, it's, uh, to be honest with you, uh, it's more like uh, Macho Man. 
<laughs> Go fuck yourself. <laughs> My daughter, uh, she it's never liked you. No. I'm going to take your girlfriend, Triple H. Triple H. Yeah. Nope. I know. It's like, oh, yeah. Like no, but for, for real, like, you lose your Vince, but there, you have, like, this really good Vince, though. I know. My it, voice it's hurts. when it's when he's it's it's like if when you hear everybody. It really talking, hurts after you do impression like that. Oh, Even it does. The you movie theater one. Like, this take care summer of coming soon. That fucking hurts, right? Hello, Sydney. Sydney, I see you. Uh, take off your. I always fuck around with like when I play Grand Theft Auto, I pretend I'm a little fucking a little chink baby. So I'd be like. My parents left me. <laughs> <laughs> but another cure mother your bitch. What? As she lay there beside me, one voice in my head relax. It's out of here. You're not the first doctor to sleep with one of his patients. <gasps> You're a veterinarian? You're That's fired. gross. <laughs> We're gonna uh now, see, you see, like, you do a good Vince. You do. Everybody does it. Yeah, but not everyone does it well. Imagine Tommy doing impressions. Oh, my God. You're fired. No, he doesn't really do... I don't know. He he just does... He just does His Tommy. own fucking voice is an impression. Yeah, he is. He's a fucking character. Like, you can put any name on it you want, and you put that voice on it, it works. I mean, or, like, I don't know, I mentioned it, like, a week ago, he would be fucking great as, imagine him in a movie playing, seriously, like, a bad guy, but <laughs> with this comedy element where, like, he's kicking the shit out of yeah. somebody, like, pistol whipping him, like, yeah, you see, yeah, and then, and Just laughing the at shit that, out of him. You know, yeah, that goofy laugh he does, you trying to make a move on me, you son of a bitch, and fucking, you know, beating the shit out of him, but he's Holy laughing shit. with his... That cackly laugh he does, you know? I don't know. It would be so funny because you'd want to hate the guy because he's, like, so mean. But then he's laughing. He sounds like Roger Rabbit. You got to love it. <laughs> Roger. Like, what are you trying to say? No. You're crazy. You know, I'll, I'll beat you like your mother. <laughs> yeah. That's right. She never loved you. <laughs> Matter of fact, she told me you weren't even hers. You were his sisters. No. The whole gunfight happens. <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, he's making him. No. Get him, Charlie. You're making him boom. No. Johnny Ace has been fucking with your girl. No. Johnny Ace. Jesus. Johnny Ace. Now, see, Tommy does have like a, uh, <clears throat> oh, I'll call it a uh, a fetish, <laughs> with uh, <laughs> he has a fetish for mobsters. Mobsters? Why? Well, I don't know. Well, he does kind of dig the whole gangster thing. He digs serial killers. What the fuck? Yeah, yeah. O.J. Simpson, but he's black. No, the glove didn't fit Cronin. <laughs> well, I bet the condom didn't. No. Ooh, didn't. The hell, I never did touch that bitch. It's raining crystal meth. <laughs> Amen. Who is this broad? Next time I call, what should I say again? I'll be like, uh, so, uh, how do you got <laughs> 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 Breast cancer, uh, gotta check for lumps. <laughs> That's a good one. I, I like that line. I like it. So, uh, so Trish, uh, how's the beaver doing? The beaver. Can I take a look? <laughs> no. Okay. <laughs> I just just a sniff. <laughs> can I just can I just whiff it? 
I'm like a bloodhound. Come on. Come on. <laughs> I can tell you how long you have to live. <laughs> <laughs> let, me, let me count the rings on your trunk. And he just, he just, it, it waits a couple of minutes. So, uh, just, just, yeah, yeah, just spread them, yeah, and, uh, <laughs> yeah. Sardines. <laughs> Candy yams. Is that, uh, Oreo? And, uh, Sardines, yes, yes. Oreos and sardines. Extra cheesy Doritos, yes. I've noticed you've been messing around with Alberto lately, yes. Yes, he, he never did take the trash out, did he? Don't tip him. It's my destiny to take the trash out, Holmes. <laughs> Clean the fucking kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> Holy uh, shit. You, uh, you fucked up again, Alberto. You, uh, you burned the tortillas. <laughs> you know, uh, Alberto, someone told me you burnt the tortilla. <laughs> That's sad for this shit. Uh, Hell, Michael, if I was your dad, I would have just pulled out and, and left. <laughs> I wouldn't I have even left a damn note. I second that, Michael. Michael. <laughs> yeah. Michael, I would have never even been in last... No, I don't know. You son that's, of a that's bitch. That's fucking great, though. I second that, Michael. You son of a bitch. I concur. And then JR comes out. My well, God. that son of a bitch, he never should have had a family in the first place. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. But you'd have a better chance fucking a mermaid. Mermaid. Yes, they have no vaginas. What do they, they have? <laughs> what do they have? Um, they have uh, flippers. <laughs> 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 they have, they have fins and uh. Baylor. <laughs> Under the sea. <laughs> Under the sea. That should be his fucking gimmick. Yo, this this is how it's gonna go. So uh. I just want to say congratulations on winning the NXT title, Finn, and, uh, I'm happy to announce that we'll be pushing you up to the main roster next month, and, uh, we're just gonna have some arrangements, some, some little bit of tweaks to your character, and, uh, you're gonna be a fucking dolphin, Finn. Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yes. A dolphin. Yes, uh, a fucking dolphin. You know, you'll be presented. We're not... Like, like Flipper. We're, we're changing. <laughs> we're changing. <laughs> <laughs> we're changing your uh, over overly hyped theme song to Under the Sea. And uh, you You're know, a, As you notice, I said duh, not the. Yes, duh. And, uh... You gotta be wearing a fucking fin. Fin? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, Your sick. manager's gonna be uh, Lana the Mermaid. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> My father. You know what, what hurts me so much, man? I think I have the biggest crush on Lana. Like, oh, honestly. yeah. He's oh, like yeah. smoking, like, oh my mm. god. Mm -hmm. But why? Why she has to be such a. She's got that, that, she looks like a boxer with that chin. Mm. He looks like my uncle, eh? eh? <laughs> <laughs> he does! Except for the great legs and the boobs and all this other, she looks like my uncle. <laughs> <laughs> I thought we were talking about Rusev here, okay. We're talking about uh, Lana and her hairy Lana. chest. No, I love Lana. I have a crush on Lana, but Rusev looks like my uncle. I don't know why he's looking. I think he said Lana looked like your uncle. I'm like, no, your no, uncle. no. Uh, shit. No. <laughs> I, uh, what's your uncle's number? <laughs> no, but, uh, you know, I, for real, have you seen her, uh, modeling shit? I've seen it. Oh, Lord. Yeah. You know, it's funny, though. She actually looks even better, like, with the fucking clothes on. Like, 
I don't know how to. <laughs> what? No, really. Like, honestly, I think it's sexier sometimes when it when. And they dress like that. Before the sh- yeah, before it ever comes off, for sure. Yeah, it's all about the appearance. Like yeah, the fucking the business suit she wears and stuff. It looks great. Man. I-